This is BBI Channel One. You welcome back again on this platform. We bring you eye-opening truth that will set the ordinary Nigerians free from the hands of corrupt, wicked, and oppressive political class. You know, in this season of electoral year in Nigeria, you must understand one thing that politics is a kind of a business, a cash out period for career politicians. And you will see some of them coming up with some kind of narrative. And this one is a good example I want every one of you to listen to. Now you watch his first statement and the second statement, and I'll be right back. Anybody can go. All we know is that uh, Papa is going there. Papa Tunubu is there. He is there already. Nothing can make him not to go there. Nothing. And uh, our brother, Ladi, uh, Ladi um, Ajomole, is already there. Ladi Ajomole has been working for us for this building. To be sincere, Ladi Ajomole and the father, his father Ajomole, have all the work paper what they write here. Now, Jomole himself, they work for us under this place. So please, uh, we are under APC, rest assured that everything in this estate is going on well. All the people that have come here, um, people, 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 what will be the name again? Labor Party have come to do meeting here before. I refuse. They have come. Are we listening? Labor Party have come. Order me, they want to do meeting here. They came to my house, which I call my former chairman, my leader, Nana. Call uh, the other leader, uh, Nixon. Tell him this is what this book came for. But my, they say, what is your mind? I say, I don't want. They say, okay. The labor people came, they want to do meetings here. I said, no, no, no. They call me this morning, say, what of to come here and they do that? I say, no, no, no. We are APC, please. So that is that. That's the first statement. Now, look at the following statement. Okay, Mbo, and when the Dakutara and Anna, the Boadia, Anna, the Mkoy meeting the Ayemeta, Bunzuko, Ayemeta, and the Madda, Mwahi Fehagano, can we keep and get the Imokota Umunai, Nopa, Noboda, Bebe, Moana, Church, Kamokato Yobon, or Koyoban Akuru, with two queer nabo. One nine woke, one nine woke, Boyan Frunanya, Boyan Chibrayambo, now Chosi Chicota and Chani Lena and Giriata. Bonya in Chani Leneso, Nakudonazo, Mua, Nezunum, Nandorum Nine, Nandeni Nebunde, Mua, Nanden Nachi, Anama Gonya of Nocuno, no, 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 Neba Mobionode, Ebama, Cayeno, Ndebamu, Moyambo, John is Mofuma, Umunemu, Ekenemon, if a man ever damage control, or yet you know Kuama, if I garden, or yet you near me for one. Good. Now, when you listen to these kind of career politicians, you see, they see um, politics as a business. Okay? And they cannot mobilize these people they bring together during meetings without money inducement. That is one thing you must understand. And they have taken positions in different political parties um as executives at different levels looking up towards the campaign money the money that will be you know allocated to them to mobilize to rent crowd to um, buy votes and all manner of um, things you know that is the usual politics of both pdp and apc that had been the standard procedure and that is what they look up to but the obedient movement is changing the narrative and they know very well that they can't even mobilize effectively people today in nigeria because the suffering nigerian people have have 
gone through this period have really taught them a better lesson and that is why you see everyone coming together to retire both pdp and apc um political structures you know that is one thing you must understand and we look at people based on their competence their capacity and their will to deliver good governance and that is why i'm an advocate for good governance and that is why you must follow what we're doing here if what you desire and aspire for your people is good governance and i tell you we will not disappoint you okay so don't get it twisted anytime you come across some of these career politicians the transactional politicians don't get carried away they are doing their business but their principal must also understand that the money they will be dishing out this time won't change the narrative for them or won't keep them or bring them back to power let me just put it that way i'm signing out just help me take this video out there so that nigerian people will be properly informed because information is power i'm signing out don't forget to subscribe like and share drop your comments i want to have your opinion but don't forget most importantly share this video like it it is making impact bye bye